I didn't graduate from high school, and I, there was a period of, of nothing for me, you know, where I didn't have, I had the worst jobs, I wasn't happy, my body was beaten down from the labor work, and uh, I just, I couldn't do it, I couldn't, you know, it was just, it was beating me down, and I was still in my early 20s. And I decided that I want to use my brain instead of my body like that. So I went back to school, and um, I don't regret that for a second. I ended up moving to BC, and um, like I said, like I, I tried, I, I think a couple other high schools, but it just wasn't a fit. I couldn't like, you know, it's a new environment, it's a new place. I couldn't find that comfort zone of what I was looking for that I had at home. And then, uh, I, boom, you know, I came across the, the the Native Education Center, and it was like, uh, this, this place gets me. I can feel this. Couldn't have done anything like that, not just with my music ability, but also with my education and my experience. You know, it's a key to comfort, I guess. You know, like you can go anywhere. Like the more you have, the more you can do. I have options. You know, like I can take a jump and I'm gonna land on my feet. If I had to pass anything on to anybody um, younger than me, it would be um, have no fear. Something that you love doing, something that you're curious about, um, in any aspect of, of life, you know, music, love, education, challenges, whatever, just have no fear. And, you know, just do it and you, you just, you won't know until you, until you try. Probably one of the, the best ways to learn about yourself is to um, go away from your home. And, and that was the difference, I think, right away is that, you know, in the prairies, they don't have longhouses, right? And you come to the West Coast, and there's these long houses and the button blankets and the regalias and the different drumming style, the different songs. And, and it was interesting, the more differences I saw in the other First Nations cultures, and it was just a province away, the more I, I learned about myself and my own culture. So the generations that are coming up, um, you know, they, they got more of a clear path than I say than, than some of us might have had. Um, and in other ways, maybe harder, but at the same time, you know, I think the further we go to the future, maybe the further we get away from the residential school experience. But the future is brighter, I think, that's my opinion, and stronger. My parents taught me, uh, my stepdad in particular taught me one thing, was just like, always have a backup plan. Get your education and then do whatever you want to do. And uh, go wherever you want to go, but just get an education.